Okay, for all you Mark 1 Transit fanatics out there, and I know there's quite a few of you, check this out for a barn find. Very early Mark 1 Transit. We think it's a 65, maybe a 66. Anybody got any better ideas, let us know. This car's been parked away since before some of you were born. Beautiful patina. Just astounding. Straight out of the barn. Lots of surface rust, but very, very little through rust. And pretty rare being a transit pickup truck. Or oh, ute. Oh, she's slightly stiff in here. Little tiny bit of rust in the firewall. Huge rat's nest in here. And an even bigger rat's nest in this side, but this thing is rock solid. That's just the battery tray that's rusted off there. Obviously because it had a battery on it. V4. You can tell it's the earlier girl with the double colored lights. But the patina is really, really cool. Like we really wanted to get it running, but just had a guy who's really, really interested in it. Mark 1 Transit Fanatic. Look at it inside here. See all the door steps are really good. So very unusual, even the door bottoms aren't too bad on it. Oh, it's really early in here. No padded dash. Good floors. Good up through here, good firewalls. Incredible, really. Glove box, which I think was an option extra back then. Let's see if we can find out what year it is. I just spied back in here. Oi. Oh wow, it's a 68, according to this. Let's go the optional. Oh, the Hayes Auto Bodies must be the uh, people who did the back on it, which is quite unusual too. I'll show you that in a second. Can't even see out the windscreen on it. 54,000 kilometers on the clock, or 54,000 miles on the clock, actually. This car's been stood for a long time. Oh wow, what's this? Ah. Oh. That's the service book. What a shame. Just disintegrated. Really door trims. Of course this would have taken a little while to get here, assuming that this isn't NZ assembled. See so the back is got a little wooden box here. That's in the empty, but how cool is that? Got a handmade box to store your tools metal sides wooden frame really lights under there but this is so cool it really is I think it's really awesome just put a tire on it to roll it and surprisingly it still rolls but yeah the gentleman who's thinking about buying this is actually thinking about keeping it in full patina like this and just repairing the little bits that need repairing which would be lovely if only they were this solid in the UK. All right, well, thanks for watching, and I'll uh, hopefully give you another one on another Mark 1 Transit shortly.